all governments give subsidies and all governments complain about other countries' subsidies. And that's nothing new. The last serious thinking about this was in the WTO subsidies agreement 20 years ago. A lot has happened in the last 20 years. So some of the things we're looking at are things like subsidies to fishing, uh, the fishing industry, which has a negative effect on fish stocks worldwide, which are disappearing in part because of subsidies, subsidies to fossil fuel production, which increase greenhouse gas emissions and thus contribute to climate change, um, that sort of thing. Uh, the major one way of thinking about this is that the rules 20 years ago were written really about subsidies that might harm another country or another country's companies, and not much attention, frankly none, was paid to subsidies that might harm what are called global goods, fish supplies, the air, things like that. So probably some of the conclusions we'll reach is you need special rules in situations like climate change, uh, the decline of fish stocks, things like that. On the other hand, you have to look at what subsidies can do positively for the environment, for technology, for developing countries. So we're looking both at the positive and negative side and trying to come up with ideas.